The shores of Lake Erie are not your typical school laboratory. And that's exactly the point of a unique educational effort initiated by NASA's Lewis Research Center in Cleveland, Ohio, called the Student Remote Sensing Project. It's designed to excite young people like these from St. Edward High School about scientific research. The measurements they're taking today were part of 18 environmental impact studies they've designed themselves. Shoreline erosion and the flow of effluent from wastewater treatment plants are two of the topics under consideration. As with any research proposal, the students had to prepare an abstract, determine the equipment they needed to carry out their studies, and describe the specific research procedures they plan to use. They'll also have to prepare reports summarizing their conclusions. While these student researchers collect ground truth data, one of their teachers, Brother David Martin, works with NASA pilot Bill Rickey to produce aerial photographs used in the studies. Their aircraft is an old T-34 Navy trainer salvaged from a storage facility in Arizona and given new life by the Lewis Aircraft Maintenance Team. Before leaving the hangar, two cameras, one a standard model and the other an infrared one, are mounted in the plane's fuselage. To Bill Rickey, who has spent a lot of time in advanced fighter jets, the T-34 is hardly a high-performance aircraft. But for Brother Martin, the experience is like something out of Top Gun. see in the imagery with measurements gathered in the field, students employ the same scientific principles used by professional researchers. And they had nothing to begin with, no cookbook recipe, no guidance, no hints. They had to design it for themselves. I want them to take the film, see what they can do with it. Maybe it will answer the question they raised, maybe it won't. But that's the beauty of science, and it, in that sense, it'll be a real learning experience. It's not something that was given to them. They can see now that uh, they can put something together which is actually their own. In a sense, they are uh, creating something new for each and every one of these experiments we did. The goal is to involve more students and schools around the country and to use the T-34 to do other types of classroom-related studies, including Newton's laws of motion and microgravity research. NASA's Student Remote Sensing Project giving today's young people a head start on tomorrow's technological challenges.